a.m. I just dropped Jaden off to school. I'm on my way back to the house to pick up our oldest son and drop him off to school so I could come home and um, go home and get ready for work. Um, so I just want to talk a little bit. Um, I know you all have been hearing me speak about a promotion and moving on. Um, I've had some people say some things, whether it be via people who watch um, my channel from work or whatever. But I have no regrets. Um, when you put a lot into what you do and you're great at what you do, sometimes people don't want to see you move on for whatever reason. But I'm not about being stagnant. I'm about being able to um, see growth so that you could grow and move on. Um, I've been in my position now 17, 16, 17 months and I already knew from the start coming in to the agency that um, I was not just going to step up what I was doing you know um, we I work for a huge county and I've been following our county for many 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 years just different things that have occurred, different things taking place, not pointing fingers, not blaming, but I believe in change. And I believe that sometimes you need a fresh pair of eyes in order to see change. And like I said, I don't know what I'm destined. I don't know what God has in store for me. But right now, I think it's my time to move forward, sit quiet for a while, um, and go underneath some great women. Um, I've been told that where I'm going now, these women are knowledgeable, uh, um, they're passionate, um, and they know what they're doing. And for me to have an opportunity, sorry, for me to have an opportunity to be able to sit under them, learn, gain knowledge, and prepare for something greater, I'm all for it. Um, you know, I'm not, in, I'm not interested in making other people happy. It's about doing always what's in the best interest for these children and families and most more, and all the time these children because children cannot protect themselves it's for adults to protect children at all times um, don't let nobody fool you um, sometimes as adults we feel that oh if something happened to a child why didn't they tell me such 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 a b and say no no that's not how it goes children are children and it's as adults or guardians or whomever it is our job to protect children i am very passionate about that um, the children on my case, I don't play no games um, when it comes to the children in my on my caseload. No, I don't play no games at all. Um, I'm not there to pacify adults. It's about making sure that they're okay. But anyways, back to what I was saying. Um, I feel that a lot of things has a lot of things have occurred at work, and I didn't understand it. You know, um, I love what I do. I put my all into what I do. I have so many what we call comp hours and I just stopped putting in hours because I was I was um, gaining so many extra hours. We don't get paid overtime um, but I wasn't able to use them so I just basically just was working. No need to put in the time because I couldn't take the time off and that's not a problem. No complaints but I believe that I've Done, I've done what I'm supposed to do in the area I was in and I definitely believe it's time um, for me to move on to do some other great things in another area um, and I think this is going to prepare me for even greater things. I am nervously excited excited to be under these great, from what I've heard been told, great women um, so that I can have the opportunity to um, grow. Um, I think there's some things that's planned for me. I don't know. So I'm just camera. Out. I, well, I'm dark, but I do believe that uh, there are some things that are planned for me that God has planned for me. But I do believe that um, I have some more growing to do, and I do believe this is gonna this is going to be this time period for me to grow. Trust me. Um, I have I've been praying and some the Lord has shed some things some light on some things and so I'm nervously excited but I'm waiting and like I said um I will keep you all in tune to how things are going once I put together my new office I'll give you all a little tour um we'll be talking more because I'll be traveling more 
I'll definitely be traveling more, um, but it's a different kind of travel, so I'm excited. So basically, um, as get me to the new year because I need to get adjusted. There's some things I need to do, some training I need to do. So definitely give me until the new year uh, where I'll give take give you all a tour. I'll do a tour of before and then after in the office. And then I'll uh, probably by the new year, a little bit after the new year, I'll be able to tell you more on how I'm feeling and how I'm, how I'm adjusting. So I'll tune back into you all in a little while. Hey guys, um, I did not check in with you guys this morning because i always got a reason in it no i just forgot this morning um well technically i didn't forget i had intentions to check in with you guys while i was at a light but my mind was running in a million different places and um prior to that i remembered that i had to put the box that um had my ttc sister stuff in it in babe's car so that she could ship it off for me today so once i did that um kind of lost track of time and had to get to work because i was going to be late so yeah but hey guys i am here now babe is on the phone with her co-worker um oh well she's not on the phone anymore she got off i got the hiccups and i'm going to bed <laughs> you need some sugar yes you do you do need something sweet to stop her. She shouldn't be drinking that water like that. <laughs> but she was on the phone with one of her co-workers um, discussing the treatment plan or whatever. So she is now fixing the boys um, dinner. We were supposed to have rotisserie chicken and salad last night. But they did not have the rotisserie chicken in the store. So babe just did um, sausages and sausages and what else pork beans so yeah so that was simple last night because she cooked big prior the day before which was sunday so since we didn't have the rotisserie chicken last night we're having it tonight and salad so something easy babe wants to go to bed early we were supposed to go to bed early last night i had the vlog edited um I had the vlog edited before seven o'clock. So we were in the bed, we just weren't asleep. Well, technically we weren't. Yeah, we were in the bed, but I had to uh, I had to get back up because I didn't package my TTC sister stuff in the box that it needed to go in. Um, so I had to bubble wrap all of that stuff so that it could be sent off today. So yeah. Um, so tonight we're going to edit the vlog i'm gonna edit the vlog early so that it can be an early night uh we we'll, we'll be in the bed early but we won't be sleep because my little people come on tonight and that's my tuesday night routine i watch them before i go to bed so and babe will probably watch her um christmas stuff christmas videos on youtube so we'll be in the bed early but we won't be sleep sleep so um once we have eaten dinner and have gotten settled in i will let babe check in with you guys and well i'll be back with her so we'll be back in a second guys so we're back hey. Hey, we'll be. <laughs> so um the kids are eating we have not eaten yet because we have some other stuff that we need to film so we're going to eat after we get that stuff filmed for you guys what you looking at me something hi you guys hi you guys it's me it's me to wonder <laughs> had an okay day today i mean i was working so hard stay in your place cool i was working so hard i didn't say nothing i see you give that side eye i didn't give you no side eye you you know my wife be throwing me under, underneath the bus back up and roll me over the girl place. shut up because don't nobody do all that I didn't give you no side eye. Y'all should. See. I was looking to make sure you was in the frame. Y'all should. Y'all should see the church hat, the, the church bonnet Lexus getting for Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely getting that church bonnet. I can't with you. I'm wet too. Right on Easter Sunday. Oh, don't do it. Don't, don't. <laughs> 
So, I mean, we're, we're, I mean, I really haven't done anything today, but trying to prepare these cases and move along and people, that's all I'm doing. I'm just trying to prepare these cases and move along because y'all already know that I'm about to be gone. And I've just been in a funk and just not really feel like doing anything. I'm, I'm just being honest. But it's important that for me to not leave my team, my current teammates, co-workers, with all of the responsibility that would have been mine. So I'm going to get it done for the sake of them. But if it wasn't for them and Jesus by my side. Oh! Mm -mm. It would have been left, but I care about my co-workers a lot. I want to miss them. So it's definitely important for me to um Help get me on To get some stuff done even though they acting up and treating me bad. Not them other people um, So yeah, that's all I got going on So guys, we're gonna say good night. So you guys think about that? Well, you be singing all the time. Uh, girl, I know. <laughs> and I promise y'all, I'm going to check in with y'all tomorrow in the morning. So you, you mean to tell me you wasn't checking in all day with the people? Not, not today. And I don't check in at the workplace. Yeah, I said they just be looking cockeyed. But yeah, this morning I was supposed to check in. But I, um, had, I told them I had to put that box in your car. So it could be shipped off. And then I forgot to check in because my mom was elsewhere. I was worried about that thing. What thing? The box. But how much it was gonna cost? Mm -hmm. Yeah, we gotta resend it. It's okay. So yeah. We're gonna say good night to you good guys. Good night. Good night. Good So the camera cut off in the middle of babe singing, so y'all just won't get that singing tonight. But we will see you guys tomorrow. Um the t shirt campaign will be over on November eleventh. So if you haven't ordered I will um I'm thinking about relaunching or doing another launch of a different design. Hopefully you guys will like that design better. But other than that, we're going to say good night again. And we'll see you guys tomorrow. <laughs> While she strolls on her phone. Good night. <laughs> Bye, y'all. So, hey, guys. Um, this will be a part of another vlog. But you all know that I have a... I'm a part of a TTC mug exchange for 2017. Told you guys about um, my TTC, sis TTC sister. So I'm going to show you guys. I didn't show you what I told you I was going to show you. But I'm going to show you guys what I got for her. And I hope she likes it. We'll start with this first. Oh, so wow. that is a, a mug that says, try your best. That's for her wife, Melissa. Yeah, and then I got this one for her. Her name is Lisa. Her says just believe. Same color scheme. Yep. And they're big coffee lovers, so I got coffee. And it smells so good. <laughs> what is it? French vanilla or something? Mm, we yeah. could smell it through the bag. And I got her this journal that says she believes she could, so she did. Have y'all catch the color color scheme? That gold and that teal and white, it's beautiful. Mm -hmm. And then I made her this. So I hope she likes it. And she has two sons, so she threw something in. She threw something in there for them. It's just starburst. Do something in there for them. For Brian and Nathaniel. So, hope she likes it, guys. Oh, and this is the box that it'll be in. And it says shine bright. So, yep. So, I thought that was super cool this year. Um, I'm going to be a part of it next year. Hopefully, they will do it too. Uh huh. <laughs> So we're gonna wrap, I already had the stuff wrapped up and I forgot to show you guys. So we're about to wrap it back up and put it in a box. I'll check back in with you guys. Send me your location, let's focus. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Get right with you, I'ma get right